Julie Bishop, a well-known figure in Hollywood, is famous for her ability to adapt to different roles and her strong presence on screen. These qualities have made her a lasting symbol in the film industry. Looking back at her work, it's interesting to think about her first movie or role that really made an impression. Now, we're interested in your favorite memory or experience with this famous actor. Was there a specific film or moment that stood out to you? We'd love to hear your stories and memories in the comments below. Keep watching as we explore many fascinating facts about her life, some funny, some surprising, and some touching. Julie Bishop grew up in a small town where her family had a big influence on her early interests, especially in the arts. Her parents always encouraged her to be creative, which helped her develop a strong love for acting. The lively local theater in her town really inspired her, making her passionate about performing. This background gave her a special way of looking at stories, which was important for her future career in acting. As a child, a few key moments really pushed her towards acting. One big event was her first time visiting a movie set. She often talks about how this experience changed her and made her want to become an actor. Being part of school plays and community theater also improved her acting skills and made her want to act professionally. These early experiences taught her to be resilient and flexible qualities that she became known for in the acting world. Her journey from a small town girl to a famous actor shows how dedicated and hardworking she is. Even as she became more successful, her early life continued to keep her grounded and show wood in the realness she brought to her roles. Her upbringing, filled with cultural and artistic experiences, was really important in shaping her as an actor. This background helped her handle the challenges of the movie industry, allowing her to give performances that deeply connected with people all over the world. In the competitive world of Hollywood, she faced the constant pressure to stay young. This challenge is common among actors, particularly women. For her, maintaining a youthful appearance was more than a personal desire, it was a professional necessity. The industry often favors younger actors, especially in leading roles, creating a tough environment for those who age. She navigated this pressure with grace, often choosing roles that suited her evolving persona rather than trying to fit into a younger stereotype. Apart from the age factor, she also dealt with typecasting. Early in her career, she was often cast in similar roles, which limited her opportunities to showcase her range as an actor. Breaking out of these molds was a significant hurdle. She gradually took on diverse characters, demonstrating her adaptability and depth as an actor. Another struggle she faced was balancing her personal life with her demanding career. The long shooting schedules and constant travel made it challenging to maintain personal relationships and a stable home life. She had to learn to juggle her professional commitments with her personal needs, a skill that many in the public I struggle to master. Despite these challenges, she remained committed to her craft, consistently delivering performances that resonated with audiences. Her journey in Hollywood is a testament to her resilience and dedication, inspiring many aspiring actors facing similar struggles. In her role as Joan Allison in The Black Cat, she displayed remarkable skill and presence on screen. The film, notable for its tight shooting schedule of 15 days and a modest budget, showcased her alongside prominent stars like Boris Karloff and Bela Lugosi. Despite the budget constraints, the film became a significant part of her career portfolio. Interestingly, the film's budget included payments not only for the main actors, but also for the actual black cat used in the film, highlighting the diverse cost involved in movie production. Away from the camera, she was a mother to Pamela Susan Shoup. This aspect of her life added a personal dimension to her public persona, showing her ability to balance a demanding career with the responsibilities of parenthood. Her role as a mother is often overshadowed by her cinematic achievements, but is equally significant in understanding her as a person. A pivotal moment in her career came in 1941 when Warner Brothers offered her a contract. This opportunity, however, came with a request to change her name to Julie Bishop. This change was reflective of the common practice in Hollywood at the time, where studios often rebranded actors to create a more marketable image. Her acceptance of this change showed her willingness to adapt and her commitment to her career. Her journey through the film industry, marked by various roles and personal milestones, underlines her adaptability and dedication to her craft. Despite the challenges and changes, including her name change, she remained steadfast in her pursuit of acting excellence. Her story continues to inspire many in the industry.
demonstrating how talent, adaptability, and personal commitment can carve a successful path in the competitive world of cinema. In her portrayal of Mary in Sands of Iwo Jima, she brought to life a character that interacts memorably with John Wayne Stryker. In one scene, Stryker tells Mary, played by her, about the inevitability of hardship in life, quoting Henry Wadsworth Longfellow's words, into each life some rain must fall. This line reflects the film's exploration of personal and collective struggles during war. Her political beliefs also played a role in her life. She was a lifelong Republican, showing that her interests and convictions extended beyond the film industry. Her political affiliation suggests she held strong personal beliefs, which might have influenced her choices in roles and public appearances. Finally, her final resting place is at Forest Lawn Memorial Park in Glendale, California. This cemetery is known for being the final resting place of many notable individuals from the entertainment industry. Her burial there ties her forever to the rich history of Hollywood and its legacies. These aspects of her life, her memorable film roles, political beliefs, and resting place add depth to our understanding of her as a person beyond the screen. They show her as someone who faced life's challenges, held firm convictions, and remains a part of Hollywood's enduring history. Exploring further aspects of her life, it's notable that her son, Steve Shoup, took a unique career path. Initially following in the footsteps of the medical profession, he later shifted gears, venturing into the aviation industry. His decision to become an airline pilot was influenced by his father, Clarence Shoup. This transition from medicine to aviation highlights a blend of interests and skills in her family. Her second husband, Clarence Shoup, played a significant role in both the military and the aviation industry. A retired Major General of the United States Air Force, he was deeply involved in key historical events and technological advancements. During World War II, as a reconnaissance pilot, he undertook the important mission of flying the first photographic survey over Omaha Beach on D-Day. His role in capturing these critical moments of history was crucial. Post-war, in 1945, he served as the base commander at Muroc Army Field, a position that underscored his leadership and expertise. His career took another notable turn when he joined Hughes Aircraft, eventually rising to the position of vice president. There, he was instrumental in flight testing under the guidance of Howard Hughes. Additionally, he led the Air National Guard of California, showcasing his diverse capabilities in both military and civilian aviation sectors until his passing in 1968. An interesting fact about her is the coincidence of her birth and death dates. She was born and passed away on August 30, marking her lifespan as exactly 87 years. This rare occurrence adds a unique aspect to her life story, symbolizing a complete cycle. These elements of her life, involving her family and her personal journey, add layers to our understanding of her. They paint a picture of a woman connected to significant historical and technological advancements through her family, while also underscoring the personal attributes of adaptability and resilience that she demonstrated in her own career.